Hey guys, Flying Dutch here and welcome back to another episode of our Japan run. I just checked up the uh, the clothes uh, situation. We are not making anything because they just left the uh, trade company, so they don't make any goods produced. They don't produce clothes at the moment. And it's going to take five years. But then we should get a nice production income as well over there from those provinces. Uh, yeah, you can go there. We are still at war with Ming. We're going after all his provinces. Make sure that everyone likes us. Let's put one back over here. What are the rebels? Ming separatists? Oh, what a surprise. Yeah, you are out of the war. This is part of Shoshone. They are also getting siege down. Need to go there. We are trading in cloves, guys. Trade efficiency plus 5%. That is really nice. We have the cloves bonus. I think we need to carpet siege a bit more. We need to get this forward going. That one. And then we can peace out Ming. I'll take a look at the peace deal. Ming, you have to return your course to you, eh? To Wu. And to Xi. And also to Min. The only place where Ming will have a coastal stuff is here. And here. I can't just stop that. I think I'm going to stop all of that. And we lost clothes. Oh, really? Well, we will get it back soonish. So yes, we should definitely uh, upgrade the clove provinces. Um, converting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I think we need to do 13 more provinces after this and we will have our achievement. And then I want to become... Uh, <laughs> I want to become Shinto again. <laughs> I don't know if that's possible though. I hope so. Ming should still have a decent amount of loans available for us to take in the peace deal. This will go to uh, to you, eh? There you go. Oh, we can't. Yeah, they are a lesser partner. I will put that in the list, so like this. Well. I don't know, maybe not. Maybe not. This will go to you, eh? We will uh, take all their coastal stuff. I guess I'm gonna give... This one as well to Wu. This one. This one. See if we can take all of this. Oh, so close. Hmm. How much money do you have? Oh yeah, I want the money. <laughs> So this is going to be the peace deal. We can peace out right now. So I think we are going to do that. Is there any reason to wait? Absolutely not. Let's take the peace deal. There we go. We have uh, some big countries now as our vassals. We can repay our loan. And yeah, we can walk freely over here and over here now. Go to Beijing. Put 
this one over here. Good war. We have this uh, this island now. Put our ships away. The Holy Roman Empire is uh, having Thuringa as their uh, emperor. Guess I can separate these these countries out. Not gonna make them vassals. That's a waste of uh, a spot. Oh, we can get a little bit of money out of you. Make you cancel all your things. And we should get more trade as well because uh, we now own more trade power. Oh, we lost an advisor. Um. Should we go on a money streak for a little bit? I think I will. Let's just take the taxation guy. We're gonna use our money to uh, start building a lot of buildings, like state houses and that kind of things. We also built a couple of soldiers' households. Uh, I mean sailor uh, buildings on the fish. Fish is the best uh, good to do this on. Um, do we have any fish? Fish is a horrible trade good. For example, this one. Not on Mushashi. Uh, these two. Are you? You are grain. You are not yet a um, soldier's household. So I guess for this state, we are gonna build the state house here. Let's just do this for before I forget. And on these two, I will build a uh, impressment office. Now you can do this on salt as well, and naval supplies and tropical wood, but fish will just stay two, uh, worth two, which is nothing. And you get the full bonus on fish. The other goods are worth more, so that's why I use grain and fish only to get those two uh, special manufactories on. We might not get any problems with sailors, but just to be sure, right? build a couple of these. Yeah, you need to siege that one down. Or are we not at war with that anymore? Yes, we are. Rebels, where are they? No idea. I have no idea where the rebels just spawned. Nope. Alright, see if we can reach uh, at least this one and maybe this one. Would love to get the 9 here and the 8. What's going to be the next thing to do? Korea is in 4 days. I'm going to go after that one. Yeah, maybe we should just go and fabricate on... Uh, Something over here. Make sure we collect our clove trade income. It's only one center. Maybe we should go to war with Sunda. Take this from Sunda, so we make more trade here. You know what? I think that's what we are going to do. Let's get some claims on it. Uh, Portugal is on Christmas Island. Should really take... Colony over here. Before someone else is getting that colonial nation. Australia is Japanese, guys. They need to stay away from it. Uh, lose some prestige. 
We will get it back instantly, I think. Uh, we are only getting a tiny bit. How's this war going? It's looking still very good. Can piece you out. Essence war in Russia, I like it. Piece you out. And we're gonna piece that one out. Actually, maybe we should just piece out right now. What's our income? 45? Perfect. Yeah, the other manufacturers are not in this list. Because we are still having them out of the trade company since a short period of time. 18 and 14. And the combat width is 29. I guess we're gonna make a new army at some point over here. But our conversion is done. Let's keep going with the conversions. To wait 16 more days and we will take all of Alaska to ourselves. Maybe I can even piece out... No, I can't. You are not uh, close enough. We'll take all of this. And there we go. Japanese Alaska is now a little bit bigger with even more gold. There are f this is also gold. Um, I hope that Alaska is going to uh, colonize it so we get more gold income. power of the bushy it's fine and we are at peace actually that is uh, insane we are at peace can you believe it no I'm not gonna give you any favors do you really think I'm gonna give you favors absolutely not we could core this but we are still getting uh, our religious ideas on the go We need to kill those though. So let's uh, send our armies over here. Take those down. And then we are going to go to war over here. Do we have a claim already? No. Let's... Uh... Oh, there's so much gold over here, guys. Ooh -hoo -hoo. We already have most of it. Oh, that's a perfect war, I think. I think we're going to do that war before Castile is taking all the lands, because Castile is already here. Oh. Castile is being annoying. Yep. No. And you want to see maps, France? Of course! Of course. We don't uh, hate you, France. No, absolutely not. Dali declares an independence war. Perfect. Let's just prepare for the next uh, war against Sunda. How many can I transport? 30 transports. Oh yeah, I still didn't build a flagship. <laughs> I, I still didn't do it. <laughs> Let's get to... Let's 
Let's just get uh, 40 transports. So we can ship a 40 with a 40 um, army. That would be amazing. So, there we go. We'll take a year and then we will go to war over there. Hey, more Shintos. I wonder if I can actually spawn Shintos after we are done with this. I'm actually doubting it. I really do. Uh, let's get the production building in Avon. Are you happy, burgers? Almost. We can almost do the full bonus on the development of our beautiful Spice Islands. Could even lower the autonomy, but then we get revolt risk, so I'm not going to do that. We'll come along over time. Yeah, I don't think those Shintos will come over. Get these three provinces so they cannot break free. There we go, the colony over here is now done. You are a full state, so we'll core you. <laughs> this province is not gonna get any building slot. We are again with way too many Monarch points. We have so much military points again. Going on a development spree soon. Let's make the Pope happy. There's no other way I can spend my military points. Harsh treatment, uh, legitimacy I think is also a military point. What is it? I think it is. We can't do that one. And we can just only develop our provinces. Make it Japan Catholic, because that is historically correct. It really isn't. Oh no. Come on, burgers, you can do it. I could do uh, this one, but no. We wait for the burgers to reach. It's gonna take a couple more months. They're gonna do this one, I think. Oh, we were already busy with you, so let's uh, encourage the development here. Spend some military points on our soldiers hubs. But I will wait until I really need to. Yeah, I know. Uh, where is this? Yeah, also over there. Are the Shintos gone? I mean the... the whatever they were called. I, don't, I forgot the name. Let's just sit here. Let the Shintos do their thing. I need to tell my vassals to be passive.
Don't kill any rebels. Yeah, we need to click next month. Oh well. We need to do the click next month and they will not be at 60 yet. Are they going to stop at 59 or... Hmm. Yeah, we need to click now. Click, click, click and click. That's that one. Well, since we are here, let's uh, get a bit more gold, I guess. And now wait for the burgers to uh, reach 60%. You should get a workshop, a courthouse. A couple more months. War exhaustion should be zero now, right? Yeah, it's almost zero. So we can uh, really do the next uh, thing. Well, we have our transport, so let's uh, send our troops over. Fur in uh, Siberia. I think we are still recruiting troops, but they are all getting recruited in the same province. I don't know why the game is doing that. It's really annoying. There we go. Oh, well, we are killing some Shintos. We got another treasure fleet. We can take the next religious ideas. I think there is no reason to wait. We now have a huge missionary strength. We are going to convert everything so quickly. Maybe we should just send these over. How many troops do you have? Yeah, should be enough. Let's get a claim on the biggest one. That one. <laughs> Ming is going to get wrecked. <laughs> Completely wrecked. Well, we do make more production income here. We also get a trade station here. But we produce more of the, the cloves. Almost done here with the Japanese conversions. Yeah. This one. And I think we're just gonna go to war. I can upgrade my ships again. Meh. I don't think I want the galleys anymore soon. I think we're gonna go full heavy ship. Heavy ship fleets. I mean, it's still an inland sea. They are still very useful over here. Hmm. Let's just not make anything go belligerent. Let's just... Uh, put them over there. We are now at war with all of this. Could take uh, these two countries maybe as well. Don't know how much aggressive expansion that's going to give us. And they are of course not co-belligerent, co so... They stay or not, they stay. Let's make them not very unhappy. And these armies are going over here. 
And we're gonna go to war in Mexico again. Did I already have a claim? Is it on you? You're not claiming anything, wow. Wait, there was gold here, right? We should, we should attack you for the gold. Yeah. We should get a claim on this guy. Yeah, you can come back because we're not claiming anymore over there. You're part of Malacca, not of the Malaccas. Mm -hmm. Let's get a port real quick over here. I don't know where their armies are, but they are not over here. Tachi is done. Mutsu. Uh, oh, there they are. There is the army. It's going to be very expensive. Uh, yeah, that's fine. The burgers are now at 60. Yes, they should get a bit more influence. I mean, I could get some governing capacity for now. Oh, we should do this one. The New World Charters. So we can colonize it just a tiny bit quicker. Yeah. Shouldn't this go higher now? Well, apparently it's not going higher. Oh well, we have 7.5%. Let's uh, use all our points. We need to do this on the green. We did this one already. Uh, this one. And we need to put some points on, I guess, this one. No, we are building a state house here. Um, well, I guess this one. That was the wrong edict. Well, damn it. <laughs> no, I clicked the wrong one. <laughs> oh... Well, let's just develop the gold mine as well, because we also have spare Diplo points. Not that much, but a little bit. What is this? Uh, we can maybe click Morale of Armies. No. Uh, inflation is actually really nice. The inflation reduction, let's pick it. Yeah. That's good. You're colonizing a bit. That's also good. We need to bring over these armies. We have gold over here. Nice. We have gold. Yeah, we are just killing their ships. Fairly quickly.
Nice. Courthouse is done. Conversion is done. Well, we now need to go here. Four more to go. Now we're turning it close again. It goes up on and off. Uh, oh, yeah, we want that building. Other ones are still not visible because of shenanigans. Yes, workshop and trade station. Start getting them here as well. There we go. So we have five of the six because this one is part of Majapahit, which is really annoying. We need to kill Majapahit somewhat quickly. Nice. Next one is this one. Well, we are going to end the episode here, guys. So for the cliffhanger, for our achievement, we need a little bit more. It's, uh, where is it? Here, we need eight more provinces. We converted. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I see nine. Maybe we don't need to do the, the Kurils. And uh, yeah, then we are having it. And then I wonder if I can get rebels spawning. from uh, the Shintos, I can put my missionary uh, maintenance to zero somewhere where we have Shintos and then we have to hope for their, uh, their, their spawning I guess. Well that's gonna happen in the next video, thanks for watching guys and bye bye.